Pound for Pound Sports Entertainment, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Listen, it's your host, F. Merritt. We're going to get to it like we always do. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Anthony Joshua is taking on Daniel Dubois this weekend. I love this matchup. I don't know how this fight going to go. Anthony Joshua has been crazy active, been looking really sharp. But then again, you can't count out Daniel Dubois. He's the comeback kid. Everybody thought it was over ever since that Joe Joyce fight. He didn't have any heart. He gave up. But no, he's been chipping away, staying busy, staying active, stopping people, knocking people out, getting the title shot against Uzik, putting Uzik down with the controversial body shot. And now he's taking on, uh, well, actually, he earns the IBF title. Take, you know, he, he wins that. And now he's taking on Anthony Joshua. Man, come on. But at the same time, a lot of pressures on Anthony Joshua. If Anthony Joshua can beat Daniel Dubois and Tyson Fury can come back and beat Uzik in the rematch, the UK can finally get the biggest fight of all time over there. And Anthony Joshua against Tyson Fury for undisputed heavyweight championship. I don't know how that fight would go. Both guys have to handle their business first. But I'm looking forward to this fight with, between Anthony Joshua and Dean Dubois. But Ty Tyson Fury and Uzik, man. Tyson Fury looked like he was in control. Then Uzik started catching on. Then Uzik started... Uh, he, he, he put Tyson Fury down. He, he, he looked like he was going to stop Tyson Fury. I don't know how Tyson Fury made it out of that fight. But like I said, Anthony Joshua, in my mind is probably the most dangerous out of everybody. Uzik has been looking very vulnerable against a lot of people lately. Tyson Fury obviously just took his first loss. He's been looking vulnerable. Um, if he loses again, it might be done. He might be retired. Um, Dane Dubois, the comeback kid, he's taking on Anthony Joshua. But Anthony Joshua, like I said, has been looking so sharp, so ready for this, so unbothered by everything. You know, there's no pressure on Anthony Joshua, but it is pressure. But he's moving like it's no pressure, taking it one fight at a time. Stays, you know, just, just stay sharp. That He's knocking people out. He's getting his money. He's just handling his own business. He's actually honestly punking people at the at the, uh, at the the weigh-ins and, and, and the press conferences, to be honest with you. But he's doing it in a very subtle way. You got to watch people's body language. You got to watch the things that he says. This man, he's a man on a mission, and I think he wants the Tyson Fury fight. He's been wanting it for years. He's He's been tired of being left out from the Deontay Wilder and the Tyson Fury saga, watching him fight three times. He, he wants to be the UK's best fighter of all time. And at the same time, Tyson Fury wants to be known as that. So guess what? Like I said, both guys have to handle their business, and then the world can finally get... I'm going to say this, the world will finally have that the, the right type of energy. The UK will have the right type of energy. The boxing world will have the right type of energy and, and promotion behind Uzik. Not Uzik, my, my bad. Behind Anthony Joshua and Tyson Fury, undisputed. Think about this, 100,000 people, Wembley Stadium. Or where they, they might put it in the UK. I mean, not the UK. They might put it over in Saudi Arabia because money-wise. But this is a UK fight. The UK people definitely deserve this. I would love to see them have this. And I would love to be in attendance for this. I think this is the type of fight where I'm coming over to the UK. If both guys... Think about it. Right now, Tyson Fury fans are kind of... Uh, I don't know, man. But if he comes back and beats Uzik... If, if Anthony Joshua... Destroys Dean Dubois. That energy is going to be there again for that fight. The public's going to want that fight again. And I want to see it. Tyson Fury, Anthony Joshua, undisputed. It's great. Uzi can take a step back. He can he can do what he wants to do afterward or whatever. But I, I, will, I want to see it. The UK deserves it. Both guys want it for legacy. It has to happen. This is the time to make this happen. Both guys have to handle their business first. And let's make Tyson Fury against Anthony Joshua undisputed. I can't wait if it happens. Like I said, hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button. Hopefully this happens. But I think this will be one of the best heavyweight fights of all time between Anthony Joshua and Tyson Fury. Hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button. It's your host, F. Merritt. Power of Power Sports Entertainment. I'm out.